Time travel, the mind-bending genre, has been tying our cerebral cortex into pretzels since H.G. Wells penned The Time Machine. These films make us question reality, time, and occasionally our sanity. Primer. Made on a shoestring budget, this indie gem is about two engineers who accidentally invent a time machine and decide to use it to get rich. Sounds simple enough, but make no mistake. You don't just watch Primer, you try to survive it. This sci-fi film takes the concept of time travel and turns it into an intricate origami that requires multiple viewings and a PhD in quantum physics to comprehend. It's less of a movie, more of a beautifully convoluted homework assignment. For now, though, if you wanted to, you can just tell her you had a good day in the market. You don't understand. No. You don't understand the questions that come with that, okay? Hey, hey. Oh, come here for a second. What's on your hand? You bleeding? There's no way I would tell anyone about this. No way. Can you think of any reason that you might? No, I can't. Sometimes we do things, no. We don't know how we got no. to that. No, I can't. Interstellar. Leave it to Christopher Nolan to make a film where love is a higher dimension and time is a tangible, malleable construct. Between the wormholes, time dilation on Miller's planet, and the tesseract inside a black hole, Interstellar takes time travel to a new level of complexity. Good luck explaining it to your friends without a chalkboard and a degree in astrophysics. Dad, why did you name me after something that's bad? No, well, we didn't. Murphy's Law. Murphy's Law doesn't mean that something bad will happen. It means that whatever can happen will happen. Back to the Future Trilogy. From disrupting the space-time continuum to racing against time, literally, in a DeLorean, this trilogy takes us on a roller coaster ride through the past, present, and future. Multiple timelines, cause and effect paradoxes, and an unforgettable pair of self-lacing shoes, Back to the Future is a one-way ticket to Confusionville. But we'd take that trip any day. You've got to come back with me. Where? Back to the Future. Donnie Darko, a cult classic that mixes teenage angst with mind-bending sci-fi. Donnie Darko is a trip down the rabbit hole. Jake Gyllenhaal stars as Donnie, a troubled teen who starts experiencing bizarre visions after a jet engine crashes into his bedroom. Time travel, doomsday premonitions, a creepy bunny named Frank. Donnie Darko is one wild reality warping ride. Just when you think you've figured it out, it tosses another temporal curveball. By the end, you're not just questioning what's real and what's not, you're questioning your capacity to process cinema. I met a new friend. Real or imaginary? Imaginary. Looper. Nothing complicates a plot like having your younger self trying to kill your older self. In the future, time travel is illegal and only used by criminal organizations to get rid of targets. Joseph Gordon-Levitt plays a hitman named Joe, who faces a unique challenge when his future self, played by Bruce Willis, becomes his latest target. Looper combines time travel with mob hits, throwing in telekinesis for good measure. By the time credits roll, you're left with a tangled mess of timelines that's as complex as the wrinkles on old Joe's face. In the future, time travel is outlawed, used only in secret by the largest criminal organizations. When they need someone gone, and they want to erase any trace of the target ever existing, they use specialized assassins, like me, called loopers. Predestination. Based on a short story, All You Zombies by Robert A. Heinlein, Predestination stars Ethan Hawke as a temporal agent on his final mission to stop a criminal known as the Fizzle Bomber. This film redefines the term time loop. 
The intricacy of its self-contained paradox makes your brain feel like it's tied in a Gordian knot. Just remember, the snake that eats its own tail is Ouroboros. For anything more complex, consult your nearest theoretical physicist. The beginning of your new life. It can be overwhelming. Knowing the future. So what, you're a cop? I'm a temporal agent. We prevent crime before it takes place. What is it? It's a time machine. Time Crimes. This Spanish sci-fi thriller takes time travel and adds a heaping serving of WTF. A man ends up chasing himself, several times over, creating an ever-deepening rabbit hole of consequences. It's a tangled temporal puzzle that has you questioning not just when, but why. Twelve Monkeys, a deadly virus, a future world in ruins, and a time-traveling Bruce Willis, Terry Gilliam's Twelve Monkeys, is a spiraling descent into madness. The film's complex narrative structure and mind-bending twists turn the concept of causality on its head. It's less of a monkey barrel, more of a Pandora's box. We've had some misfortunes. Unstable types. For a man in your position, an opportunity not to volunteer could be a real mistake. Definitely a mistake. The Time Traveler's Wife. Romance meets time travel in this heartbreaking narrative. It's the tale of a man with a genetic disorder that causes him to unpredictably time travel and the woman who loves him. The non-linear timeline and the constant temporal leaps add a layer of complexity to their love story that makes Romeo and Juliet look like child's play. It's a beautiful melange of love, loss, and loops that leaves you both emotionally and cerebrally overwhelmed. We just happened to each other in the wrong order. Any hobbies? I'm your future wife. Triangle is a mind-bending horror thriller that bends time and reality into a pretzel of confusion. A group of friends on a yacht trip find themselves stuck in a deadly time loop on an abandoned ship. It's a Bermuda Triangle of logic, causality, and sanity that throws you into a cyclone of existential dread and temporal disarray. By the end, you'll be so twisted up, even an army of chiropractors couldn't straighten you out. Edge of Tomorrow. Imagine Groundhog Day with aliens and exoskeleton suits. Edge of Tomorrow traps Tom Cruise in a time loop on the day of a fatal battle against extraterrestrial invaders. Each death and revival reshuffles the deck of events, pushing the complexity to new heights. The film's tagline, Live, Die, Repeat, could very well be the mantra for anyone trying to untangle its time-twisted narrative. How many times have we been here? How many times? For me, it's been an eternity. <gasps> Arrival is not your traditional time travel movie. This linguistics-based sci-fi drama, instead of using a time machine, uses language as a means to perceive time non-linearly. We're thrown into a cerebral maze where the beginning is the end and the end is the beginning. It's like trying to solve a crossword puzzle where the clues are also the answers. Now that's a proper introduction. We need to make sure that they understand the difference between a weapon and a tool. Language is messy and sometimes one can be both.